Hello, everyone. Today I'm with Santa Clara freshman point guard Christian Hammond. Thank you for joining me today. Of course. I'll start with my first question. How old were you when you started playing basketball? Um, I've been I've been playing basketball since I can remember. If I'm being honest, I mean I don't remember, really remember. I say probably since I was born. It's always been something I've done. So you always had the ball in your hands, always around the game. Yeah, for real. Did you play any other sports? Uh, yeah, I played baseball when I was younger, up until sixth grade, I think, and then football. I played it up until my senior year of high school. So you played football for a long time. Yeah, yeah. Football was my other main sport. High school team was pretty good. Yeah, so you played for Cherry Creek, right? Yep. So you guys were like a powerhouse in Denver. Yeah, we won state in the last four years, so we've been doing pretty good. Yeah, so a good team to be a part of. Yeah, for real. What made you decide to transfer from Cherry Creek? Um, I knew, I think, I thought that transferring would probably be the best option when, um, I really knew, like, uh, yeah, I want to take basketball serious, and I don't want to really, like, like, football's fun, but that's not what I want to do when I'm older. And, I mean, just transferring out of there is, like, the coaching that you get from just, like, prep schools and the day-to-day, -day, like, basis, not going to, you know what I'm saying, like, working out more and all that. Yeah. So that was, like, the main reason why I transferred. It allowed you to, like, solely focus on basketball. You didn't have, like, traction with other sports. Yeah, exactly. What was the most intense high school basketball game you ever played in? Uh, shoot. We played, well, my senior year, uh, we played Link Academy at Dream City. And uh, that was a pretty intense game. It was close going back and forth the entire game. Uh, so I was really, that was a really big one. And then we played uh, Prolific Prep. Every time we played them, it was pretty intense. And then played Bella Vista. And uh, the final four, the grind session. And that one was real intense because both two teams from Arizona. So that was good, too. Yeah, I bet. So you had back and forth games and prolific prep. They're always loaded with guys. Yeah, they're always really good. Who's the best player you've ever played against? Um, Shoot. I mean, I'd have to throw my brother in there. Obviously, me is pretty talented he's a pretty good player but um Caleb Foster he going to Duke he he was real good and then um Aiden Holloway he's pretty good too he's a prolific point guard so he's pretty good really shoot the ball so yeah yeah so you got a lot D1 guys and your brother he's at Colorado right yep so I bet like you got to play like in the driveway just always growing up oh yeah for sure did he teach you a lot? Like it helped. Did it help being younger? You know, like. Yeah, I mean, more just seeing him do something that I wanted to do. That's more what helped. Cause I mean, um, me and him play like pretty different. I say, so um, I mean, obviously there's stuff from him that I take like, um, mainly like his mindset, like his work ethic that really rubbed off rubbed off on me uh, when I was younger. But um, yeah, I mean. There's stuff that I tell him or try to teach him how to do, and there's stuff he tries to tell me how to do. So, it's yeah, cool. so you each help each other. Yeah, exactly. What made you pick Santa Clara? Um, mainly just like the fit, and uh, I think it's a really good fit for me and like my play style, and um, also like they just like the coaching staff, uh, how much love they show towards me, and I feel like they showed that they were the most interested in me. And, uh, I mean, when you're getting recruited, that's, like, the main thing that matters is going somewhere where you feel like you're the most wanted. Yeah, definitely, because, you know, you're going to be – it's an important part of your life and spending a few years there. And so you want to know that they want you there as much as you want to be there, too. Yeah, exactly. So you felt that from Santa Clara, which led you to your decision. Yep. How does it feel that you'll begin to play teams like Gonzaga and St. Mary's? Um – Feels good. I mean, that's a really good competition. You know, you always want to play against some of the best players in the country. So I'll be really excited for that. That's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah. So you get, you know, the big moments come from the big time games, and you get to play some of the best teams in the country. So you're excited. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. What kind of role do you think you have freshman year? Um, 
I mean, it's early. I mean, you don't really know too much, but um, hoping that I'll, um, you know, be on the court as a freshman, making an impact for the team. Um, just can't really say too much about all that. I mean, you don't really know until this, until it happens. So. Yeah, so just hopefully make an impact, but you know you'll keep seeing as you go along because you're practicing with the team now and stuff, right? Yeah. No, we, no we start practice. We we start practice like July fourth, but right now it's just like workouts and like playing like five on five or like three on three and stuff. Yeah, so kind of getting with the team and everything, so it's a nice way to get in. Yeah. I heard isn't there like a nice like lifting like place at Santa Clara? Yeah. Um, yeah, it's actually right below me, basically. Yeah, that's but, cool. Yeah, it's really nice, really nice gym. And uh, we're gonna be going hard in there for a while, so yeah, a lot of, you know, it's the summer grind, always grind. Yeah, exactly. What are you most looking forward to at Santa Clara? Um, just like, I mean, the basketball for real, I mean. This is the whole reason why, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm in college, why I came here. So, many just like the games. Like, yeah, I'll probably say the games. That's what I'm going to be most excited for. So, the games, you know, the college basketball games, the atmosphere, you know, the fans watching. Yeah, yeah, all that. What are your goals for your career at Santa Clara? Um, I mean, that's, like, a tough question. I mean, that's, like, kind of far down the line. But, I mean... I just know, like, things that I would want to be, like, remembered about me is, you know, like, I'm a hard worker, and I just don't – I like, I want to be someone that, like, people remember, like, years from now. You know what I'm saying? Not just someone that yeah. just, like, left. Just want to really make an impact here. And, um, yeah. Yeah, so just a hard worker, you know, leave that for the other guys, too, and she likes that they remember you, like, it's like – be remembered like how Steve Nash, I'm sure, is remembered there very well. Yeah. You can be like that, too. Yeah, exactly. How would you describe yourself off the court? Um, I'll say I'm pretty chill. I mean, I'm pretty to myself unless, um, like, I know you, like, if I'm, like, really close with you and I'll talk, but if I don't, then, you know, kind of just listening to music, just chill. Um, Yeah kind of quiet i mean i play video games though so i mean that's really what i do to keep me from not being bored but yeah i say quiet yeah so it's kind of reserved to yourself and that's like it's yeah. like a really close friend then you talk but you know overall you kind of just keep to yourself yeah yeah then the last question i was for fun you get to take any three nba players to dinner it could be past or present who are you taking uh oh I know for one one of them will be Kobe for sure. He's he's my favorite player. But um yeah, Kobe, MJ, and uh Steve Nash. We'll throw Steve Nash in there. Yeah, the Santa Clara alum. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you know, three greats right there, and Michael Jordan, in my opinion, the best basketball player of all time, and then like Kobe. Yep. The mama mentality. Yeah, for real. That'd be a great damn for sure. Yeah, it'd be it'd be interesting. It would. You get a lot of experience. Yeah, exactly. Are you a Nuggets fan being from Colorado or no? Uh nah, if I'm being honest. I mean, I don't really have like a favorite NBA team, but I kind of grew up liking the Lakers because of my parents. Um, so I was kind of a Lakers fan when I was younger, but um, once Kobe stopped playing, it was kind of like, oh, like, I just kind of watch players. Yeah, I get that. I just like players. Yeah, you know, you didn't get you guys that you could root for. Yeah. All right, thank you for taking the time to join me today. Oh, yeah, of course.